In today's video, we will experience true joy. Oh! It finally dropped! Oh my god, dude! And also make some very bad decisions on the one life road. I don't have any- if I fall off there, I'm dead. I don't have anything to like reduce my fall damage. Oh, please! Wait, I don't have sprint. Wait, that's actually quite bad. No, no, no. No, no, no. Give me a sec, give me a sec. Pot, 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 pot. I just need to run. I just need to run. Oh, nice! Greater agility. Oh. Oy, 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 oy. Okay, let's make some Isles of Emulation, guys. This is quite good for AoE, guys. It does 50 damage every three seconds for 15 seconds. If I'm having a bunch of mobs on me, I have AR up and I have Blade Flurry. I pop a, an Oil of Emulation and we just do a buttload of AoE damage, right? That's really good, actually. We can make a buttload of agility, po agility potions. We'll make a lot of these. And I guess we'll just keep some crystal vials, vials on us in case we can get some Songgrass, right? And I guess we'll is gonna get today's level and going guys yeah let's go that's how we do it all right let me get the rogue scre the rail creature here so the emulation auras we can use for some special stuff which will be fun right but we'll see let me just pop this here little ar blade flurry what a better way to start off the day guys by killing two mobs at once here popping some cooldowns and absolutely blasting that is scary though a 10 second silence jesus christ okay, let's do that and then this one as well. Okay, and then we just do this twice. Oh, it's a, it has a cooldown. On some uh, private servers, guys, you could actually spam click this and escape at the same time, and you can basically complete the quest in one go. Since this is not a private server, we can't do that. But there was, I remember uh, being able to like finish this quest in basically one creature immediately, which was pretty bu pretty busted, actually. There we go, nice. So now we can pick up the thing here from the mob as well, and we can talk to this, and then we got that quest done. All of these mobs can drop their hide. Actually, if you're a skinner here, you can get these super duper fast, but we are not a skinner. Regardless though, we're gonna get a lot of XP just for killing the mobs. So I think it'll be fine regardless. So we gotta get a lot of these hides here, guys. That is where today's journey commences. Okay, let's go into the Eddie Cave, guys. Nothing bad could happen in here, right? We'll see. Let me just pull this guy over here and then get this guy as well. And then we'll just do a little bit of this, guys. Some big damage. That's what we're all about. There we go. Let me just get some of this stuff. Ball steep into cave. We're going into the cave, man. I feel like as long as we take the mobs one by one, then overall, we should be good. Huh? This guy doesn't have pockets. Oh my god. This reminds me of the time when we played Bigfoot with Savix, man. <laughs> Dude, that game was actually really, really fun, man. Oh my god! 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 Okay, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him! Okay! I'm fucking in the bottom! Hey, you! Hey, you gotta take a picture of him before I die! Wait, I don't have a camera! Take a picture! Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! Are you okay? Are you okay? Yeah, yes. you hey, yo! Hey, what are you also doing? Hey, Man, I want to do more of those things, man. Like, I, I like those kind of games. Same thing with, like, when we play Backrooms. That was so good as well. Yeah, I think we'll just slowly work our way through this cave, guys. Okay, just one Yeti at a time. We need to be careful about these because they do enrage, right? So that is something we do need to just be a little bit wary about. I do have healing potions in case we do get in trouble. So we should be... That's the enrage right there. That's the one. It does so much damage when it does that. Okay, we got some stuff though. Yeah, that mob is coming close and I don't have any distract up right now. So let me just do this. <gasps> What's that? 42 attack power. Because mm. we lose 6 stamina and some strength and a lot of agility, right? We lose a lot of dodge and a lot of crit, right? Like 18 agi is a lot, guys. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna use these. They are quite good, but let me just see. So like attack power? Attack power goes up by a lot. Oh my god. Wait, maybe they are quite good, actually. <laughs> yeah, they're definitely quite good. What about my crit? 10.61. 11.48, right? We also lose armor and have some dodge, right? Trading 1% crit for like 10 AP. Yeah, I don't think it's worth, man. But they, they... And the HP, right? Yeah. You gotta realize it's the armor. Ooh, what this? Yeah, it's also the armor and the HP. Ah, it's not worth, but they do look better, man. They do they do look kind of cool, right? You know what, guys? We're playing Fashion WoW. We're gonna use these. By the way, we have a chance at getting the chicken egg when we're leveling here. Every single mob we're killing can drop us the distress beacon. And we want to be able to get that so we can do the chicken escort. So we will see if we're gonna be a lucky duck and get that, guys, right? I think we'll just go over here, do all the ogre quests, and hope while we're doing those that we get the chicken escort. If we do get the chicken escort, I are Carly, uh, then we will go back here and we're gonna do the escort, okay? So we need a little egg up here, guys. A little egg for the little Wawa. And I think. 
I think I can sniff one up here, guys. Yeah, there's an egg right up here, isn't there? Oh, I sniff it. Oh, there it is, dude. The hippogriff egg. My senses were right. So we got the egg. It's huge. I have you know that I broke my glasses the other day and thus see like absolute garbage until oh. I can get new ones next week. To ensure that I will not miss out on any content, could you please narrate out what you're doing? I'm currently mounting up on my stripe the night saber and I'm searching for in the ruins of Isildan for a, uh, a bunch of ogres. At the moment, I am running past a ruin on the left, and there's a tree on the left as well. There's also a little ramp that goes upwards, which I'm now going to be running up. I'm currently running up the ramp in search of more ogres. I just got dismounted on my mount because you're no longer able to mount uh, up on the platform here. I'm currently panning my camera around so I can find some ogres, and I'm running up towards a ruin in Fellwood at the moment here. I see a mage lord on my left, and I see a battle master on, uh, in front of me. There's also a mage lord on my right. I'm gonna enter the palace right here it looks very very similar to the palace in uh like the the the, 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 the priestess of the moon place in darnassus right i see a shaman on my left here uh, and to my right there's a, a little uh, little pool i accidentally pulled a mob behind me which i'm not very happy about so now i'm killing the mob here that i just pulled it's called a battle master he has two axes one in the left hand and one on the right here as well so i'm using a sinister strike to do some damage on him and i'm also trying to uh make sure that i don't die at the same time he currently uses the moralizing shout which would which reduces my attack damage by a, quite a bunch here. I'm gonna make sure that we kill the mob right now. The mob is now dead. I gained 540 XP from that. Now I'm gonna be moving over to the shaman on my left. So I'm gonna be pulling the shaman with a thrown weapon and I'm heading over to the other shaman on the right side here which goes up towards the ramp. I'm making sure that I gouge the shaman so I can make the other shaman come up to me. I pop the slice and dice here, evasion and a blade flurry into a uh, adrenaline rush and then I'm doing a lot of damage. I'm keeping a little bit of extra energy in case the mobs heal here. Eviscerate coming up, then I'm kicking the mob on the right and then he's gonna be dying here. The mob on the left left is also just about to die. I killed one mob there and killed the other one right there. So now I finished off the shaman quest and I got myself like a nice little shoulder piece right there which gives me nine strength and nine uh, spirit. It actually is quite a good uh, shoulder piece right there but I do think I have better because mine currently has 13 agility on as well. Right so now we finished the place here with the shaman so which means that we can leave the um, the palace now. So now I'm running out of the palace and I have my, my poisons running out as well here. The, the battle master is just about to catch up to me but I'm running away just in time here. I'm now applying my poisons again to my main hand currently. I'm looking around for some warlocks as I'm doing this and I'm also gonna be applying the poison to my offhand as well here Now I'm gonna be looking down to find some more warlocks But the warlocks are more so in the northern quarter of the zone, right? So I'm gonna henceforth uh, attacking the mobs here in the ruins of Isildur And I'm gonna be moving up further to the northern part of the zone here because there's gonna be more warlocks and the warlocks uh, I need currently need seven more off <laughs> We're gonna stop, okay? I'm gonna <laughs> Oh, yeah, so now we're gonna do the quest up here. We're gonna go to the little camp with all the mobs and... Uh... Yeah, yeah, okay, that's the plan. We are gonna clear a little bit of this camp before we free them. Because when we free them, they kind of just go everywhere, right? So, yeah, we'll do it like that. Uh, okay, just doing this here. Oh, let me pop an oil emulation, guys. This is an emulation time. Okay, holy! Please, yep, 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 yep. Do like that as well. Nice. That's why we have the oil, guys. For the big extra AoE right there, dude. Holy! That is a lot of mobs. Oh, she pulled an extra mob over there as well. I think we should be okay, though. Yeah, while she's tanking that, I'm gonna bandage myself up real fast. Yeah, we're good, guys. We're good. I have everything under control. As per usual, guys. Don't worry about it. Obviously, we got under control. Do that. Let me just free these guys up. So these should just get out now, right? Because we cleared the entire camp, sort of. Because they, they pull a bunch of mobs along the way. But I think since we cleared most of it, then they get out, right? Bro, I don't know. They're just everywhere. I think I am getting the quest done. That one over there, I can't save, though. Oi, 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 oi. Uh, why so many mobs? Let me drink a emulation potion here. Hot there. Kill this guy here. Still got the emulation up. Jesus Christ, man. There's way, way, way too many mobs. Okay, we did it, we did it, we did it. 
Here we go. Yeah, now she is like pissed that we, you know, they, they did that stuff to her pet. So now she wants me to go kill them more again, right? Already told you, Kindle and I will now take the fight to the Grim Totem. Yeah. Together, we should still be able to pick off some of the Tauren without much threat to ourselves. But we'd love some help if you're willing and able. Uh -huh. You've seen the camp below us, but there are more to the east. Using your own tactics, deal as much damage to the Tauren as you can. Mm. We can all meet back here after they've felt the sting of Kindal's arrows and your own weapons. This is some bloodthirsty mm. stuff, man. Listen, we just freed the little thing. So now you want to... Okay, this and then we're good to go. Man, dude... I can't imagine, guys. Very, very soon, we're going to be getting Thrash Plate as well, which will make us even more powerful. What? Kindle was right about you, adventurer. You do have a knack for this. I do. You are a more seasoned adventurer than the both of us. I know. And for that, we thank you. No problem. The Grim Totem Clan is much more hostile than most Tauren. Okay. I wonder if their own kind frowns upon their actions. I wouldn't be surprised. As you are probably aware, many races on Azeroth have ties to less kindly counterparts. But that is a discussion. Didn't you just massacre the entire village and you calling them hostile? The Torrents were like taking some some sprite darters and like, you know, caging them up and, and like, you know, using them as fodder or whatever. You just massacred an entire like village of Torrents. And then she's like, oh, they are less kind. Like what? I mean, I did it as well, but I guess so. Out here in the wilderness, Kindle and I have meager means to reward your help. Okay. But we don't want you to feel unappreciated. Take my signet ring. If you ever find yourself in the bowels of Teldressel, go to the Temple of the Moon in the heart of Darnassus. Okay. There you will find my high priestess, Tyranda Whisperwind. The ring will let her know that we are well and give credit to your story. We both thank you, adventurer. I wish she would say Wawa. Can we? Is this stupid? Ah, it's fine. Just three mobs here is fine. Focusing the Mystic first. Can we go on this guy? And then the other guy will die as well. Hey, look at that damage, dude. With all the cooldowns up, man. Oh. Nothing can st nothing can stop us, chat. We are unstoppable. The Wawa will never die. There we go. Please give me the egg. I'm just not getting the egg, am I? Well, here's the quest here. And then we're gonna turn in that parcel over there. Oh, gosh. But first, we gotta go into the little cave. Pull the tunneler there. Evasion, blade flurry, everything up here. Thank you for your patronage. And we do some damage, guys. We are not doing a lot of damage, I feel like, though. Okay, we're good, we're good. Okay, everything is fine, guys. Zoo. Yes. The community has given you much lately. What are you going to do for the community? What? Spin the wheel, Guzu. Spin yeah. it. Okay. Fine! God damn, man! God damn. Okay. Bam. Yeah, you do this here and you free Rascal. I don't think you have to do anything. I think he just like RPs a little bit and then you're good afterwards, right? Yeah, that's basically it. But we didn't get the escort thing, right? We could go grind a few mobs and see if we can get it, but let's hearth back. Yeah. Dude, I dinged. I didn't even... <laughs> Wait, I didn't even like uh, realize we were about to ding. What the hell? Oh shoot, the level 46 guys. Damn, we're getting more melas. Yo, not bad, not bad. Ding, grass. Thank, thank you guys. Thank you. Appreciate that, man. Ceremonial blade. So this is really good for dagger, but we're not gonna. We are not dagger. So uh, I think I'll just take the rod because it sells for more. Yeah, I'll do that. Good luck. And we're gonna bring that to Darnassus as well. Um. Okay. Very good. Yeah. So we could. We we could do Sulfurak, right? But I really want to do the the mallet quest. But yeah, let, let's farm these mobs a little bit, guys. I got a timer running, and let's see if we can actually get that chicken escort quest. Okay.
So maybe that Yeti quest together with the hide and then also the... Th <gasps> I'm drowning! Oh my god, sorry. I, I, I was completely not paying attention to the breath meter. Jesus Christ, I was thinking about like the... Where we could go and farm. Okay, yeah, okay. All right, I have one last resort, guys. I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna do this quest. I'm farming some good old yetis because I need to get an egg. The egg won't drop, so I keep farming them anyway. I am losing my mind. We've been farming for over an hour. But that is already after we have done the quests already that we needed to do. So this is actually taking a lot longer than I thought it would. I thought this would be a thing we would get really early. But it's not dropping, as you can see. <gasps> oh! It finally dropped! Oh my god, dude! The distress beacon! Dude, I don't know how long we farmed this, man. I think I farmed this for the total time being here. Like, I think three and a half hours. I am Thomas! Thank you. All right, let's do this here. And oh, we get some really good shoulders. Damn, 10 strength, 10 edgy. Can't I just... Uh-oh. Yeah, that thought, no, not that, no, no. Not gonna work. All right, let me just pop Blade Flurry in. Oh my God. Uh, okay, actually, this is a little bit too many mobs. Uh... Okay. Mob is half health, but so am I. I think we're okay. I have a potion as well. I used all my cooldowns though there. Not the most optimal, but... Don't want to use a potion though. If I use a potion as well, that's very bad. After this, we will be able to have our uh, blade flurry up for next pack, I Can think. Can the robot run through these mobs? Wait, what if I... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, let me just do this. Focus the brute and that way, and the other guy is zapped, right? My cleave is not that great without the uh, AR up. But it's still okay. That guy's gonna run away. Gonna hop on this guy as well. At nine second left on sap. That's fine. Yeah, there's a ton of fire bloom in Tanaris. Yeah, I know that. Bam. To eat mermaids? Who eat mermaids? There we go. Okay, nice. Look at that, guys. Successful venture into Feralaz has been uh, commenced. Turn in the quest? Yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Nice. Let me just do this here. See you later. Oh, is that actually better? It is better. Dude, we got a lot of gear today, guys. We got the uh, we got the boots, we got the uh, the chest, and we're gonna get those shoulders from the chicken escort. We turn it in in uh, Booty Bay, though, the chicken escort, guys. We have a few quests to turn up in Darnassus here, and then we are shilling. Okay, that's good stuff. All right, let's turn this quest in here, and then yeah. this as well we'll pick up. All of these quests are stuff that we can uh, we, we will do a little bit later, and we're just gonna get a, a buttload of XP, right? Which is also amazing. Uh, this quest right here leads us over to the book in the corner right over here, which we then we will pick up, and then pick up the next quest. Hi, Mayo. Right, so this brings us to Tenaris, and then there's one more quest as well. So we're, we're kind of just like, I mean, we're just picking up and turning in a lot of quests that we will then do later as well, right? Oh, this is the quest from earlier with the uh, spirit darters and stuff like that. Okay, um, shouldn't we? Oh yeah, we can get skills now as well, right? Uh, let me just see here what we can get, guys. Let me just check out the stuff here. So, um, oh, we can get a new rank of Sinister Strike, guys. I really love Sinister Strike. This is a really, really good ability here uh, that we can train. 
Very nice. Okay. It always feels so nice coming over to a trainer and training some new skills and stuff like that. Because you, your character really, really gets a lot more powerful. I think the next rank of instant poison is like level 52. Yeah. Okay. So we got a new Sinister Strike. That's really, really, really amazing. And we also got a new Garrote, guys. Honestly, uh, I think we made some amazing uh, progress here, man. We, we, we really conquered a lot of stuff today, guys. And that is very, very good. collector i see one right there i see another one over there oh he stole that one that's fine okay i'm gonna get these two guys here actually i can get, I can get three guys no I, I'll, I'll just do two guys oh we could do three maybe this is stupid actually hold pop this here our, our love emulation then we do this as well we got the oil popped oh my god these guys hurt man there we go see if we can get it guys the duke land no no no. Huh. Okay, here it is, guys. Let me get the Duke Land. Oh, nice! Honestly, that wasn't that bad. Okay, so when we're here, chat, we want to avoid the Swarmers. Because they spawn a bunch of little mobs that are really annoying to do. These guys, we, are, we avoid those. We just kill the Stingers, basically. Like, these little Wasps. The Wasps has Pryo, right? Sulfurag win. I need to do Sulfurag after 48, because I want to do the Mallet, guys. I really want to solo the Mallet quest, and I need to be, like, 48 or so to be able to do that, right? Please give me the Insect Ports. Oh, these guys do poison on me, man. Anti-Venom? I don't have any Anti-Venom for this. Okay, let me do this here. You want to do it? I will. What do you... Ah, uh, I don't like this. Yeah, I can't bandage, but we're, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Yeah, my Blade Flare is not as strong as it used to be, man. Dodge, okay, tight. Can you please? Jesus Christ. Okay, four more parts. I do not like this place, dude. Okay. Bro, I don't have any- if I fall off there, I'm dead. I don't have anything to, like, reduce my fall damage. Oh! Please! Wait, I don't have sprint. Wait, this is actually quite bad. Wait. No, no, no. No, no, no. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. I actually don't... Pot, 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 I just need to run. I just need to run. I have nothing. I actually have nothing. What am I doing? The trinket, the trinket, the trinket! Please! Leave me alone, man! Oh my god, let me get out of here! Get me out of here, man! Oh my, I have nothing! I actually have nothing! I, I'm just avoiding those, like, the big boys I'm avoiding. Oh, nah, he's in the cave. Maybe he's not that far in. It, it, guys, he's not a rare elite. We can go in and kill him, get the loot, dip out. He's in there. You, you see the square? He's in there. Oh, shit. Tunneler, tunneler. Pull the tunnel. Okay. I need to get past here. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Popping everything. Oil of emulation as well here. Just massive damage. Dude, this is easy! 
Easy, easy, easy. Just you need to just kill this guy now. I don't know if he spawns anything or anything like that, but we should be able to get it done. What's that? Armor reduction, that's fine. Guys, it's easy. Oh. There we go. And we get the insect part. Hold. I yeah, just need to get the insect part. Parts in three minutes? Yeah, yeah, I, I know, I know, I know. We're good, we're good. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm, I'm dipping out. No, we're dipping out. We're gone. We're done. We're done. We're good. Everything is fine. We were not even close to dying for a single yeah. second. Everything was completely good. Okay. Keep it real. God, man. Time is money, friend. God, and now she wants us to go to uh, uh, Keep it real. to Eastern Kingdoms and get some stuff done there as well, right? We, we got it. We got it, man. We're almost level 46, by the way, dude. We are making some insane progress, actually. Really, really, really insane. Almost 47, guys.